Hi guys, this is David, and welcome back to Let's Play the Magical Land of Waz. Let me see. I'm sorry, it's been so long, I've forgotten the way. Let's just start walking while I try to remember. Figures. Why aren't you useless? Ooh, here we have a new enemy. Let's see. Let's use quick. Perfect. Okay, this is the Orobance, or Oro Ants, or whatever it is. It has 70 HP. It has a special attack, Mucus, which decreases your speed, as you just saw there, and it's weak to ice. So, eh, nothing too horrible or anything like that. But anyway, we're here in the uh, in the Romwind Forest, because we needed to pass through, and Sullivan said that he knew the way through, but eh, it doesn't sound like he does. It sounds like he was maybe lying or something, because, uh, yeah, you know, old age gets to you. I guess he's not that bad of a guy. I don't think he's a liar, so... We'll just trust him. I'm sure he'll figure it out and we'll head on through. Ooh, she learned a new invention, Denden. Den. And in the next town, we're actually going to get to an invention machine, and I'll talk about that more then whenever we get there. But I'm just going to head to the spots first. So there are those two Let's guys. Let's talk to them, see if there's anything new to say. The water in the cave is called Evian. Sounds kind of like Trace BN. Thank you for clearing out the cave. Now we can get to the water safely. Okay, well, yeah, they needed the water. It's kind of interesting. That they know French, you would think that, you know, they would have no clue about anything French-related, considering this is, like, a different dimension or world. Yes, yes, go west here! Or was it east? Big help you are. No shit! <laughs> Ooh, we get an attack drop that uh, increases your attack power. And we actually do it west, it just takes you back to those wizards that you saw earlier. So we go east... Keep moving, trucking along. Ah, yes, the way out is straight to the north. Might be straight to well. the north, but I want to grab some treasure. Fire Ruby, that is a fire attack uh, item. And again, we see that it's weird yeah, item. I'm sure we'll figure it out soon enough. Let's just keep moving. Oh, this does look like the way out, actually. Oh, what is this? Aha! The way out is indeed blocked. Maharad, Lord of the Forest, what have you done? Ooh. You are known as the Holy Tree! Why have you done this? Silence! The rain is a blessing to me. Leave me. As I feared, he's been taken by the fear rain. Holy Tree poisoned by the rain! Open your eyes! <laughs> Good effect, I like it. Shut up, old man! Leave me in peace! Hey, Gramps, what was that? It was my greatest power, with which I chastised the servants of evil. So, you just yelled at him really loud. <clears throat> at any rate, we must save Maharad. It's not too late. If he, re if he remains under the effects of the Fear Rain, this forest will become a maze that no one will ever escape. Alright, leave it to us. Boss time! Against Maharad, so we're going to have shot attack, Leona will still attack, and Sean, I'm going to have him use telekinesis. Uh, Maharat has 2,700 HP, so quite a bit of HP. Uh, he's weak to fire, but we don't have a fire ability, and he has a special skill, Bad Breath, which I'm sure we'll see soon enough. I hope it's not with the Bad Breath from, that the Marvels use. Ooh, also, Limit Slap. Ooh, 91 damage that the Marvels use in the uh, Final Fantasy series. That would not be good at all. So what we're going to do is uh, keep on doing the same sort of thing, Shun, hopefully Rock Toss will happen, like we saw whenever we were fighting uh, Balamo, and it dealt like 500 damage, rather than the piddly, what is it, like 81 damage the Sandstorm does, 87 damage, whatever. So, uh, if we get low on HP, we're just going to have Leon heal using potions. I have about 10 potions, that should be enough to get us through this battle. If not, I'm kind of screwed, so, eh, we'll hope and pray. But anyway, this is, um... Could be a pretty difficult fight, and um, this is pretty much the same. Oh, there we go, Bad Breath, 111. Ooh, and it paralyzes. That's no good at all. So this is um, pretty formulaic, same sort of thing. So anyway, I'm just going to cut it here until I actually defeat this guy, because this is going to be about 20 rounds of the same thing. Shot attacking, Shun dealing telekinesis, and Leona either attacking and or healing. So I'll... Uh, I'll catch you guys in a couple hey, minutes. I am back. That fight was pretty hard, hard won, and I um, 
actually had to use all my potions, so I remember that I had that fire ruby that I got, and I used it, and it dealt about 400 damage, and that finally wiped him out, because he was, you know, he's weak to fire, so awesome. 250 gold, 200 experience, and some nice, well-deserved, much level ups. I really hope the next town is is uh, nearby, because man, I need some healing. Oh, it's you, Sullivan, my friend! It's been so long since I last saw you! I think he's finally returned to normal. I was soaked by the rain. It felt so good. I fear I've caused a lot of trouble. Let me open the... Open the path. <laughs> I was about to say, let me open the rain. I was about to go to the top of the thing. You there, Archer! I'm sorry for the trouble. Let me make it up to you. I'll teach you a technique used by those in the forest. Learn new ability. Power shot. Power shot is really, really good for shot. The path is clear. Now put a stop to the fear rain and defeat Balam as soon as you can. Maharad and I have much to talk about. Aren't you worried about the monsters? Whatever. See ya. What a jerk. <laughs> Let's talk to you. I'm looking forward to the end of the fear rain. Do you have anything to say? The power shot technique allows you to attack with double your strength. Make good use of it. Yeah, it's really nice. Okay, so out we go. We're leaving the Romwin Forest. And, oh, right here. Really, game? Really? Right in front of the fr He's still paralyzed? Really? That sucks. Right in front of the, uh, frickin', uh, Terrace. Oh, shit. 64 damage. Holy crap! Oh, damn! Yikes! Come on! If if I can kill a boss with 2,700 HP, and I get killed by these random assholes in the world map, I'm going to be pissed. Come on! Seriously. Seriously. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Damn. Oh, good lord. Oh, shit! Holy crap! Two oh my god! Come on! No, not Ragtaws, no! This is gonna kill one. I want him to kill all of them, unless it is a multi-target. Is a multi-target? Sweet! Oh man! Whew! Oh, by the skin of my teeth! God! Okay, thank God I'm right here in town. So I am at the village of Jick. <laughs> Shoo! You guys sure have some strange stuff. Can I see your stuff? Huh? Oh, this? It's called a CD player. Oh, I was using a southern accent to shop. <laughs> eh? That's my diver's watch. This? It's my laptop PC. Don't break it. Hand it over. CD player, dive watch, and laptop. Oh, what great shoon! It's amazing! What is this? Looks interesting. Let me see it. Ah, oh, what are these letters? How to use this thing? This wash doesn't break when you put it in the water. Wow! Here, let's put this in the water next. Ah, oh, my laptop! Stop that! Wow! A silver frisbee! Idiot! Don't throw my CDs around! Look at all these little gears inside this! Oh, please don't break my watch! Fantastic! Amazing! There's lots of mosquitoes inventions! Let me see! Damn it, guys! That's it! We're really sorry. It's just because this is Jick, the alchemist's village. Everyone here really lacks unusual things. We don't mean anything by it. Please forgive us. Yeah, I don't know if that was a southern accent or me just kind of slurring my words. Anyway, I'm going to cut here for a second so I can heal up and revive and all that good stuff. I'll be back in just a minute. Okay, I'm back. I used the N. Got all healed up, as you can see here. 
So let's uh, explore Jig Village. Let's talk to some people. Hmm, I want to build something. I guess I should go ask Medisto for advice. Eh, maybe. A lot of people talk about this Medisto guy. The workshop's on the upper floor of the tavern. Have you seen it yet? East of the village, there's a huge building that was one of the Great Laboratory. Hmm, isn't that interesting? It's up to you. West of this village lives a great alchemist known as the Technomaster. His real name is Badista. He's a strange fellow, but very smart. Oh, well, that's nice. So we can... I've already used the inn, but we can go up here, and we can check one of these jars. There we go. We can get a potion. Nice. I'm going to have to stock up on some potions, because I am out. Because that boss really... Ugh, he did a number on me. Man. Okay, but anyway, we can talk to this guy and use the cannon, which we'll do later on. But uh, let's talk to you. Mr. Medista was a good person. He always takes out the trash, and he's such a good neighbor. Well, that's nice to know. And here we have a weapon shop with lots of good stuff here. But the only thing that I want to buy is just an H Wazooka. I guess it's like a hyper Wazooka for Leona. Everything else, we will get uh, a much better upgrade really soon. I'm going to go ahead and buy some more potions. Buy about ten of them. That'll come in handy. Uh, I have four magic teas. That's good. Uh, I have a I need a hot cocoa. Um, yeah, I'll buy a couple sirens. Why not? And what is this? I'll meditate. I'll buy two of those. Fireworks. Save the metal. Yeah, I'll go. Okay. So, let's get out of here. And talk to you. It took us 100 years to build this cheese tower. Yeah, as you get to the top, you'll really see that it actually is made out of cheese. It's kind of cute. Okay, this is the workshop, and those people down there just explain how to use it. So you can either build, repair, disassemble, or invent. So let's see what build does. Okay, so here we can create various different things, but you have to have the equipment. Look at the upper right hand corner. Leona has five potions, but she does not have five bronze bows or one Namnun to build a Den Den. Uh, Siren, also, she can't make. She can't make this or a potion X, but she can make a Meditate. So let's go ahead and make that just to see how it works. Why not? So we can make a Meditate, which heals paralysis. Okay, easy as that. Uh, no, I'm good. I don't want to create more. So that's inventing. And then if I want to repair, which I really can't do right now, repairing is if you have vehicles or robots or something like that, you can repair them because they will fight and get damaged. And then disassemble. If you have an item, let's see, we'll use an item. So if we have an item, like let's say this pepper bomb, and stop to the enemy, you can disassemble the pepper bomb and it'll turn into two magic teas, one antidote, and one meditate. But uh, I don't really want to do that. Let's see. Well, that'd be kind of nice. So you can do that too, if, if, you know, if you have an item that you want the, the lesser items for. So that's all inventing is, and as you get more equipment and more items and things like that, Leona really does start to shine uh, in regards to inventions and such. So that could be really nice. Let's talk to you. I'm worried that my little ones will be affected by the fear rain. Oh, no, we'll worry not. I'm here. So let's uh, go up here, go over here. Move, you little brats. Okay, move over here, and a secret passage! Awesome. I'm guarding this here storehouse. We sure are. You find a scrap of paper with words, live purely and honestly. Hmm. Well, that's nice. Potion X. Jewel. 300 gold. A really poorly done painting. And an antidote A. And I'm going to meet you back. Okay, I'm back outside that woman's house, so let's keep on trucking. Let's go on up here and go inside this house now. And talk to you. We used to have a bungee jump set up on the terrace, but people got hurt, so we had to stop. Oh, is that right? Well, we got a hot cocoa. Nice. And let's head on out here. Let's look at this, uh, this uh, bungee cord. <laughs> <laughs> Whew, that was dangerous. Ah, oh, you're telling me. Okay, well, we need to head back up there, but let's do it the fast way. Let's do it the quick way. Let's talk to you. Want me to launch you up to the top of this cannon? Sounds like fun. Just climb into the cannon. Sure thing. Let's get in. Okay, I'm set for launch. Are you ready? Well, wait a sec. Okay, here goes. <laughs> 
the looks on Chun's faces, that is hysterical. Yeah, you can really see the cheese tower here. Okay, so, let's go over here. I'm gonna sign. The finest viewing spot in all of Magic Land. Jumping prohibited. Okay, very nice. So, uh, from here, I am going to call this a day. Um, next time on the Magical Land of Pause, we're going to keep on exploring. Try to find this Medisto guy and uh, look and see where we can get some better weapons and armor, because believe me, it's not here. Uh, if you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good day!